It's too early. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to choir tour. Good Well, on this installment of Casey and Sam's Adventure, we found a train and it's also a diner. And there's the front of the train. I am actually obsessed with this. You gotta come here one day and eat. <laughs> We're still on the road. I think we got like two more hours. I got applesauce at applesauce. I'm coming. Okay, say where you're going, say where you're going. I'm getting food. Come on, Fusion. We'll see. She's like it. McDonald's. I don't know, maybe Arby's. I don't know. Arby's. Go ahead. Arby's. Arby's. Oh, uh, well, Arby's. Dude, I didn't know you were video. I don't know. Arby's. Arby's. No idea. No clue. We are how many officially hours? engaged. Not me and her, but. Did you bring your watch? <laughs> you did it? I had it in my car. <laughs> it's in your car? Every restaurant. <laughs> We'll have a score from one Why to Why is your voice yes. giving me youth pastor in 2000? <laughs> Casey is a very interesting on how he um, rates food. Too. Pretty much uh, today he's been wrong. Mac and cheese was from Sheets and I gave it a nine. He straight up lied. It was good. It was, it was giving me North Carolina mac and cheese. But uh, can we agree? You can't, you can't judge a chain by the location. That's a bad point. However, however, part of a chain should be its consistency throughout. However, I do know I that McDonald's does change some of their recipes from location to location, like over the Mason-Dixon line. Really? Stuff will get hotter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Review. <laughs> Thank you. 